Okay, today's puzzle. Best move for white. All right, so let's try and get into the mindset of this puzzle. What are the checks on the king? Doesn't look like there's an immediate checks on the king. Looks like it's a material type gathering situation. So is it going to be one of those funky ones? Let's see. So bishop takes, rook takes. That doesn't look too good. If we get arty and rook takes the pawn, attacking the rook. Rook doesn't have to take, but if he did take, then the king would take. I don't know if that improves the position because then the bishop just takes the bishop. Right. This rook can't get to the king because the bishop is blocking. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Let me see. What can we do? What is the picture? This one looks like it's going to be such a simple move and I'm overthinking the whole thing. Capture the bishop. The bishop is on the rook. So we've already gained a piece by going here. The issue I've got is he doesn't have to go and take this rook. He can just go back up and put a check on. Oh, in fact, he could just bring this rook down to put a check on. I move up. He can't go up anymore because the pawn is there, so we're free. And he can't go and take the rook because he's other rook will get taken so I think it's that simple isn't it I think it is that simple of just taking that because it's on a higher piece they can't then attack me again and again I suppose if they went with this rook with the check same thing applies I suppose we go up and if he comes across and attacks yep let's go with that so we get a tick and then obviously they've gone straight away so we gain some material good to talk okay this puzzle find the best move for white okay let's see if there's any immediate checks on the king queen is stuck in this little corner now it's got a check on the queen the rook is hanging at the moment. Rook can come here attacking the queen. And behind the queen is the pawn. So it'll probably go up still defending the pawn. But then the rook can take with a check on the king. So it's... Yeah, alright. So... Is that too fancy? No, it looks okay, doesn't it? Rook up on the queen. Queen can go anywhere, really, can't it? So we have to be mindful. Just doesn't have to go back because it's not going to be really defending the pawn. But it's not got to check on our king. That's not really... Yeah, the issue they've got is once that pawn goes, then our queen can take this knight because this pawn is the one that's supporting. I think that's the way it's supposed to look. So goes there, maybe the queen goes back, still keeping an eye on, on the knight. Rook takes with a check on the king. King moves. It's not going to go here because the rook's there, can't go there can go backwards or it can go to the side here ok 
Okay, so it can, can, just two spots, yeah? And the queen is still defending that. Rook is here, the queen's there. Mm. Don't know how it finishes though. Don't know how it finishes, it gets a pawn. Oh, queen goes back, rook check, king goes back. Maybe it's not that, maybe it's not that. That looks tasty though, because it's attacking the higher piece, it's leaning on here. This, I don't think there's anything else. Queen takes the knight. No, that's not going to be working, is it? Queen attacks the rook. But then it develops the rook. It can come here and add more pieces to the frame. I think it's this. Oh, we, we did say that it can go anywhere. So it's come down here rather than supporting the knight which kind of makes it a little bit easier in this process because the rook takes, then the king just moves somewhere, maybe not there, maybe here or whatever. It, in any event, it's getting a check on it, I think. And then the queen just takes the knight. So that's made it a bit simpler. So we're going to go with that. Yeah. Yeah. 